crónica de almas 9 un violento enfrentamiento cuando Kili despertó Max decidió no re reprenderle sino consolar al guerrero que se sentía culpable Kili y Maxi viajaron juntos y terminaron forjando una estrecha amistad pero un día se presentó ante ellos un hombre que bloqueaba su camino Are you that Nunchaku wielder who wants me dead? Maxi? I have no idea what you're talking about. Even so, what's the deal? What? I thought all warriors knew you have to strike first. Hold on a sec. Looks like we're done talking. I may look easy going, but I never back down from a challenge. <laughs> you're sure one plucky fellow. I will honor you with a duel. <laughs> Don't blame me if you get hurt. Mitsurugi. Battle one. Fight. My philosophy is to strike or be struck. I can get on board with that. Ready? Yo, ma, de vuelta, de vuelta, come on. Okay, well. He fallado. Ojo, me tira. Wait, what do you mean you got the wrong person? <laughs> I'm sorry. I am Mitsurugi. So many people want me dead, it's hard to keep track. Seriously? You may want to rethink your life choices. Well, if you seek Soul Edge, the most powerful weapon ever, you're bound to attract trouble, right? Soul Edge? We've got our own beef with that. Well, this is quite a coincidence. Let me just give you this word of advice. Beware of the ninja Taki. Soul Edge and her go hand in hand. So long! The hell was up with that guy? No idea. He put up a good fight. I'll give him that. Is everyone that's looking for Soul Edge like him? Just try not to overdo it, okay, Maxi? Ha, <laughs> you worry too much. If anything, you're the one we need to keep an eye on. <laughs> <laughs> 